Alrighty, hello YouTube, ZShadow64 here, back with another Inez run. This time I got a, uh, a full level 70 team, so hopefully uh, we make it to round 13. Now, I'm going to use that uh, same strategy I mentioned in my previous video, so we'll see how, uh, we'll see how this run goes. And, unfortunately, I am slowly running out of stuff to uh, do videos on. I mean, I've pretty much uh, covered just about every event, uh, except for DR. I think I might uh, make a video for that pretty soon as well. But, anyway, uh, thank you Mark the Maker and Malakar for uh, helping me out here. They are in my guild and um, Superior D is in a well he belongs to another guild but he offered to um, help us so shout outs to him as well and I'm still gonna kinda stick pretty close to Inez here stick to her like glue I do not want to um, have happened what happened in a uh, in the last video where I had to um, waste the healing on Inez in uh, one of the earlier rounds. I think it was like round seven actually or something, but it was pretty earlier in. And this team actually uh, doing fairly well here. Distracting the bosses away from Inez, and um, she's not taking all that much damage right now, which is good. Oh, I better uh, send out a heal here. There we go. Everyone fully restored. Die. All you monsters, die. No one loves you. <clears throat> and you know, I, I can't believe you guys can hear that tapping on my screen because let me tell you it doesn't <laughs> it does not even sound that loud like I I can't even hear it even if I try to I cannot hear myself tapping on the screen so that is very strange but I'm trying to uh, not let him like self-conscious of it. <laughs> After I said that, I'll uh, I'll probably start tapping the screen a little, little less loudly. But you know, it's this, it, it's this game. Um, you know, I it, that actually reminds me too, because I want to do a, um, a bug report video for the game. To kind of let the devs know everything that uh, is messed up in this game, and one of the things is um, is just all the buttons in this game. It like it takes like five touches just to get something to respond. It's absolutely awful. I've I've never seen a game um, have uh, such such a bad touch UI like that before, though. I don't even know how you go wrong um, making that, but yeah, whatever. Uh, everybody's using their buffs a little bit early, which which I don't. I don't really like, but I, I would rather everybody save their buffs um, until round 12 because I really don't feel like we need to be using them this early. But uh, we'll uh, we'll see how this goes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Almost got me.
So it looks like we're for sure going to make it to round 11 with Inez. Still, uh, still in good status, which is good. And uh, I'm going to try and distract the gold monster again because we don't want, don't want him getting close to Inez. Especially when uh, round 12 comes around. We want her to be at full HP for that round. Nope, 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 nope. Back off. Back off, buddy. There we go. Okay. Here we go. So I need to... I need to... Use, my strategy is going um, to be just keep Inez healed. For the uh, crap, 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 heal. God dang it, man. I think we got it though, because I was able I was able to stop the gold boss from um, coming near her, and how I did that was I planted my healing circle ahead of time, because that gold boss is what really does the damage to Inez. Um, you know we can we can kind of mitigate the damage from the uh, lesser enemies, but once he gets to Inez, then that's when things get serious. So that's another little tip. Um, just remember to cut this boss off before he reaches Inez. And then you can go back and uh, kind of focus on the others while he's still distracted. <clears throat> but we are doing good so far. I haven't had to use any diamonds, which is nice. I actually haven't had to use um, <clears throat> any diamond or buffs, which is extremely nice. Okay, no, no gold enemies here. And keep these guys distracted. Oh, God. Oh, God, man. <laughs> we are trying, like, so hard. My God. And, yes, I used, uh, I used diamonds, but that's okay. It, uh... It was worth it in this situation. <clears throat> because we got uh, we got a you know a fairly good team here actually so. I don't know guys it's looking uh, looking pretty grim we'll see what happens though. we will see what happens 45 points crap come on come on come on really need to start getting these orbs as well as soon as they uh, as soon as they spawn <coughs> there we go Okay, now we got a gold person, so I'm going to lay down a little. Oof, holy crap, man. 
see that freaking damage? Jesus Christ. Oh, man. There was no hope for that round. Holy crap. He just came and absolutely stopped us. My God, man. Mr. One-Hit Wonder there. All right, well... That was, uh, that was actually a fantastic run. Oops. And, uh, that was also a new record for me. I know, I know lots of people have made it to round 15, but I've never seen anybody make it, uh, past 15 before, so. <sighs> that was a, uh... That was a good, good team though, and um, I'm actually very pleased I finally made it to round 15. So, uh, like I said, I, I haven't seen anyone that's made it past that round, so if you have found a strategy that works really well for round 15, um, let me know guys uh, down in the comments. Give me a few pointers and hopefully I can... Uh, come up with a good strategy to get past that round there but thanks for watching and um, I look forward to seeing you guys in my next video